did. Thumbs down. But that very last Bitler of Hitler, thumbs up. And by the way, do not take that image out of context. <laughs> too many! It's too many! It's too many pills! It's not the drugs that make them cool, it's their confidence. <laughs> Pretty obvious reasons for dumbbell ownership right here. It's not called a workout if you don't put the work in, Brosef Bronrad, trust me. But white people were created when a sale at Coles fucked a true crime podcast. Our main story tonight <laughs> concerns the potential problems in corporate consolidation of local news. Don't you dare change the channel! I just had a lobotomy, but it turns out I'm both happy about it and surprisingly horny. And good old-fashioned jizz. That is an impressively strong stream, so I do totally get it now. And going forward, Every time I think of Mitch McConnell, I will think of that donkey. A, Adonis-like, B, Herculean, C, striking for a man of his age, or D, not my thing, but I'd still hit it. <laughs> Hitler didn't outlaw haircuts. He was a fascist about personal grooming. Other stuff too, but mainly that. The point is, cocaine is an effective weight loss option. The clown pubes. You probably didn't even know that you had lupus, but you did, but you don't anymore. It's a miracle. It's a miracle. Even for the non-puppet population, unemployment is an especially pertinent topic right now. Doesn't get more Canadian! It just doesn't get more Canadian than this! People with cancer can grip it, rip it, and strip it with the best metal thieves out there. In fact, cancer patients have been some of the best five-finger copper shoppers that I personally know. In a way, I've been married 5,000 times. In another way, I come in the cake. <laughs> just the way they are, and they don't need to conform to your completely unrealistic standards of farm animal beauty. Hashtag swine is sexy. Hashtag feminism. Harvest. We did it, guys. We did it. We did it.